everyone and welcome to Acidity's Toyscape. Today we are opening another slime package from someone on Instagram named Slime Grandeur, or maybe it's Slime Grandeur, I'm not really sure. Anyway, before we get into that, let me give out the Toyscape team shout out. Today's shout out goes to Kendra and Jensen. Please go follow their channel and, well, subscribe to their channel and check out their videos. They're very sweet and very supportive. They're always so nice to me. So anyway, let's get into this. So here's the package. Can't really see the whole thing. Okay. It's not really interesting. It just says Post Logi, which is the courier that we use here in Malaysia. Oh no. Let me cut off. <laughs> anyway. So this is the back. I'm going to be really careful about Oh god. Anyway, this is the back. It has private information on it, which is why I covered it. But up here it says... Oh jeez. Okay. Up here it says Shopee, which is the website that I purchased this on. It's a selling website. Anyway. So, let's Let's just get into it. Let's get straight into it today. Okay. So here it is. Let's take this out. Oof, that is a lot. And it's not going to sit up. But that's okay. We'll just lay it down there then. See if there's anything else in here. There's this. And. Ooh, this. And. Okay, yep, that is all that's in there. Put that aside finally, so we don't have to see any private information by accident. Okay, so first let's look at these things. These little extras. Here's this. Oh, there's her card. Let's get this open. Let's see if there's a... Okay, here it is. Take all these things out. I'm going to lower my camera so you can all see a little better. There we go. So I got three of these candies. Let's see. This is Cloud9 Fresh Milk Flavored. Get the camera to focus. Not focusing. It's still not focusing. There, yeah, it says Fresh Milk Flavored. Okay, so some milk candy. My camera's having lots of trouble focusing lately. I got some foam beads, some white foam beads. I'm not sure if this is for one of the slimes or if it's just for me. I got two bottles of activator. So that's nice. If any of the slime is too sticky, I can activate it. What else is there? Okay, so let's open this next. It's a, it looks like a little note. Uh, okay. Let me just see if this has any private information before I show it off. Yeah, this is just a receipt. So, I'll keep that. It doesn't have any private information on it, but it's not necessary. Okay, so here is her card. It has a very nice marble, marble look to it. So, slime grandeur. And her... Oh, oops. Sorry. Here is her Shopee, Reen1205, and her Instagram, Slime Grandeur. I hope I'm saying that right. And here is the back. Thank you for choosing us. Enjoy your slime. So, yeah, it just has some slime care information. We'll look at those after we open the slime because those are meant to go with some of the slimes. So let's open this. It's really nicely packaged in bubble wrap, so nothing will break, hopefully. I don't think these containers that she used are fragile, but it's always good to be safe, especially when you're selling something like this, because if this does spill out, it would be very, very bad in the packaging. Okay, 
I always struggle a lot with packaging. If you have seen any of my videos, you will know that. Okay. Here's the bubble wrap. I will definitely be keeping that to recycle. I love when I get bubble wrap. Okay, so here is all the slime. It is a lot of slime because I purchased a lot. So it's in this nice baggie. I'll open it up and take all of it out. One, two, three, four, and five. Oof, that's a lot of slime. Okay, so look at these containers. These are quite nice, don't you think? Especially this one. This is a really cute one. Well, okay, I will get right into it. I'm going to pick one. I will pick the first one. This one. So I'm going to put these aside here. Put those over there. And so here is the first slime that we're going to be looking at. Here is her logo. I really like how it's clear. And you can see the slime underneath. That's really cute. So here is what it says. Honeybee slime. Scent honeydew. RM750. So that is the that is the name of it, the scent and the price. Um, if you're wondering what that price is in US dollars, then in US dollars it is one dollar and about about one dollar and eighty cents. I wrote it down here. <laughs> so the description for this slime on her website is a thick honey colored clear slime with three honeycomb sponges in it. It is scented as honeydew. And there's a, a how to play instructions here. It says, you have to squish the honeycomb sponge until there's no more slime in it. And after done playing with it, store it back with the slime and repeat. So that's what these are. These are the honeycomb sponges. So again, I'll say, after you're done playing with the slime, you have to squeeze all the slime out of these sponges. Probably because it will dry up, or maybe it doesn't fit in the container. We'll find out soon. I'm going to keep this so that I can restore these little sponges. So here are the sponges. They do look, they do, are, they are the usual sponges. They're quite rough. But they're still soft. They're just kind of rough. Which is perfect, because I think that's... I think that's what she was going for with the honeycomb kind of theme. So, okay, let's open it up. It might be melted. Hmm, it seems pretty good. Let's open this. Ooh. Okay. Put that aside. Take this out. Ooh, look at that. I already really like it. It's not really that sticky, and I live in a very hot climate, so that's always a really good thing. Look at this! It's so nice! What the heck? I've never purchased from this person before, so I don't know what to expect. The last time I did a slime video, she was someone I ordered from very often, so I knew that I would be getting the best of the best. This is really nice slime. I mean, look, it's stretchy. It's not sticky. It's really not sticky at all. Especially since I put the lotion in my hand. So, it's, it looks like honey as well. That's very nice. Let's do this. Okay, um, before I add in this, oh, I, I can smell it already. <laughs> I was just about to say that I'm going to smell it. So, I'm going to bring it up to my nose and smell this. It does, I don't know if it smells like honeydew, but it smells very, very sweet. It smells really, really good. It smells really sweet. I'm not sure how to say it. I'm not sure exactly what it smells like. Maybe that's just what honeydew smells like, because I don't actually know what honeydew smells like, to be honest. Let me smell it again. It smells really good. <laughs> It kind of smells a little like medicine as well, but like good medicine. So let's put these in. I'm a little scared. Put all three in. Fold that in. Okay. Let's 
squish, squish. So here it is with the uh, honeycomb sponge in it. Let's take one of these out. And look at that. Ooh, bubbles. Very interesting. I'm not sure if I like the sponges. I kind of prefer it without the sponges. But since there are only three sponges, you can just take them out. And you are I think you're supposed to take them out anyway. You're supposed to squeeze the slime back out of it and take it out. If you don't like that extra bit of work, then you can still buy this slime, actually. You can still buy it because... You just don't have you just don't have to put the sponges in. Okay, let's make a little swirl and then move on to the next slime. Good enough. Okay, I'm gonna put it back. Okay. So so far I'm really happy. So let's move on to the next one. I will open this one. Okay, so this one is let's look at the tag on there. Pearl. Okay, you know what? I'm pretty sure this is French, and I don't know how to pronounce it. Even though I studied French in university and got an A, I still don't know anything about French. Um, well, I'm pretty sure in English that means white pearl. So anyway, sent lychee, and it cost me seven fifty in U.S. dollars. Seven fifty is. Let me check. 750 is 180. It's just it's the same as the other one, but I think I personally got this one for one ringgit less, which makes it like 160 dollars. I mean not not 160 dollars, like one dollar and sixty cents. Yeah. Okay. So there's not a lot of uh, information on her website about this. It just says sent to this lychee. It's from her metallic slime series. She had a few metallic slimes. This is the one I purchased because. I actually wanted a different one she had. I wanted the rose quartz one, but it was sold out and I didn't realize it was sold out until last minute. So I was like, well, you know what? I'll either get gold or this pearl one. And I ended up getting the pearl one because I like Steven Universe. <laughs> yeah, that's basically why. Oh, there's stuff in it. Ooh, pearls. I didn't know that was gonna happen. What a surprise. <laughs> a slime surprise. Okay, it comes out really nice, just like the other one. It's not that sticky. It's really not sticky at all, to be honest. So here it is. It is metallic white. It's really pretty. It has pearls in it, which I didn't know. And I, I mean, maybe not everyone would like that, but I personally think it's great because it suits it. I'm usually not so big on purchasing slimes that don't have little fix-ins, if you know what I mean. I don't know why, I mean, Oh, you know what? I didn't do the little clicky test for that one. Really nicely, really nice and clicky. Um, I don't show it very well because I'm bad at slime. But this is really nice. It's stretchy. It feels really nice, not sticky. And the color is pretty. Look at that, that's nice. I did a nice throw. Congratulations, me. Let's do another clicky test. Okay, good enough. So now I'm going to smell it and see if it smells like lychee. It does smell like lychee. It smells like fresh lychee. Let me smell it again. Okay, just now it did not. <laughs> I think I smelled it wrong. Is it possible to smell things wrong? Let me try again. Well, I mean, more or less it smells like lychee. So, okay, I'm going to... I'm going to put it back in the container so we can move on. So the next one I'm going to open is actually this one. Because I did not purchase this one. This one was a free gift. That's a nice container. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Put that there. So this looks like white slime with like... I'm not sure what these are. Oh, they look like black brownish sprinkles this one feels a little stickier than the other ones but you know i didn't purchase this it's just free so whatever you know i don't really care i mean it's free so i'm not sure if this slime has a name or not i'm gonna smell it 
I can't really put my finger on what it smells like. Let me try again. It does smell good. It kind of smells like lotion. I'm not sure if that's the point. But it's really nice. It's really nice to get free, like, a little free slime, you know? Which is a fun thing. So let's make a swirl. I wish I was better at making swirls for y'all. Anyway, we'll put that back. We don't really need to review this because it's not... Like I said, it's not something I purchased, so... Even if it was terrible, I would still be happy about it. That's not terrible at all. It's really, it's still really good slime. <clears throat> it's still really good slime. Sorry. So next, I am going to open this one. So this one I am pretty excited about, to be honest. Okay, let's look at this. Hollow Coke Scent Cola RM8. So that means it was 8 ringgit and in US dollars, it's about two dollars. Okay, so the description for this on her website is cola slash brown colored jelly cube clear slime with bunch of chunky and fine chocolate colored hollow glitters scented as cola. I'm really excited for the scent of this because I just think cola sound like it smells really good. Ooh not sticky so far. Really good sign. I believe she also had this slime for sale in a, in a container that looks more like a glass, but that one was sold out, so this is the one I bought. I think this was the only one left. I think a lot of these, there was only one left. Okay, oh, there's a lot more glitter at the bottom there. It's kind of, the glitter's kind of sticking there. And kind of put it back in. That's not really a problem, if, in my opinion. Ooh, look at this. Look at the glitter. It's so pretty. It's hollow. I know a lot, a lot of people really like hollow things, especially nowadays. There's jelly cubes in it. The jelly cubes are, in my opinion, supposed to look like ice. It's nice and stretchy. Let's try and do the clicky thing. I'm not sure if I can do it with the jelly cubes in it. Well, okay, let's try again. Well, I tried. It's not really the slime's fault, it's my fault. Okay, good enough, you know what? Okay, good enough. Even though I didn't really do it. You know what, I have to try again. I don't want to disappoint anyone. Well, okay. <laughs> That was definitely a failure. Well, you know what? I can't do it. But that's okay. Not all slime has to click. At least in my opinion. I'm going to take out one of these. It's just a normal jelly cube, I believe. With all that. It's so pretty. So pretty. It's like glitter. It's just like she said, hollow and brown. Brown hollow glitter. So that is really, really pretty. I really like this. It's not my favorite in terms of playing with it. I much prefer this one. This one is really, really fun to play with. But this one is so, so pretty. It really is just beautiful. Let's put it back. Oh, you know, I didn't smell it. I gotta smell it. I really wanted to smell it, remember? It does smell like, it does smell like cola. Let me smell it again. Hmm. It smells like cola, but it also has a hint of something else. Kind of like medicine-y. I'm not sure why I smell medicine in all of these. Maybe, maybe it's something she adds in. It's not really a bad smell. It's not a bad smell at all, actually. It does smell like cola. I like it. I like this. Okay, the last one. If you hear that beeping in the background, it is someone selling probably bread on the motorcycle. Um, if you're not familiar with Malaysian culture, then, well, someone just goes around on a motorcycle selling, like, bread and snacks, and you can stop him and be like, yeah, I want to buy some bread. Basically, that's it. I'm not really that familiar with Malaysian culture myself, because I'm not from here originally, but I'm trying, you know, I've been here for 13 years. Anyway, 
the slime. Sandy and Shelly scent lotion. RM15. This one was a bit more expensive because it comes with some really cool things. These. Anyway, so the description for this one is very long. I have it written down here. Anyway, so before I say the description, 15 ringgit in US dollars is about $3.60. Cents. Yeah, cents. In Malaysia, it's sen. Anyway, so all of these in all of these in US dollars is pretty cheap. I'm not sure if she ships internationally, but just so you know. Anyway, so here is the description for this one. Super fluffy and drizzly cloud slime. Highly recommend to people that never touch cloud slimes and people that love cloud slime. That's me. And this slime is really, really soft and it drizzles so nicely. Also, it might leave a little snow fallout, but it is really easy to clean. I don't mind if it leaves out leaves snow fallout. I've had some that does that before and I really don't mind at all. Um, anyway. Mm, this slime is scented like lotion. It was originally scented like ice cream vanilla, but the lotion overpowers it. This slime will come with a pack of three real seashells that I picked from Terengganu. One umbrella, orange and yellow fake sprinkles. Okay, doesn't that sound so interesting? Okay, so yes, like I said, this is cloud slime. That is supposed to look like sand, and it really does in my opinion. The reason why I purchased from this Slimer in the first place is because I saw this um, on her Instagram, I believe, and I was like, wow, that looks like sand. I, I'm really interested in that. And then I saw that it comes with three seashells that she took from the beach herself. So I was like, wow, you know what? I definitely want that. So I bought like three more as well. <laughs> so I could show you guys, especially. So let's take these out. Oh, you know what? I probably shouldn't have poured that because there's sprinkles in it. That's okay. I can pick them up. So let's look at the seashells first. She picked these, these are real, real seashells that she picked up from the beach herself. Um, it's hard to focus. Well, okay, it's not really focusing, but here's one of them. Here's another one. These are really pretty real seashells, you guys. Not fake. <laughs> that's what, that's what real means. <laughs> okay. Here's another one. Really cool. She got these from, like I said, she got these from Terengganu. And that's a, a state in Malaysia. I don't, I'm not very good at ge <laughs> uh, geology. Geology? No, not geology. Oh my gosh. Ge geography. I'm not very good at geography. So, I can't really tell you exactly. I can't tell you much about Terengganu. So anyway, this umbrella has like little rubber bands on it to keep it closed. Maybe not rubber bands, but they can't really stretch. Anyway, so here's this little umbrella. Uh, I've seen these plenty of times before. I don't know if it's a Malaysian thing, but it's just a little tiny paper umbrella. You can open it like an umbrella, you can close it like an umbrella. It's really, isn't this adorable? Have you ever seen this come with slime before? Maybe you have, but I haven't. Let me put that over there with the seashells. And here are the little sprinkles it came with. They're just heart-shaped yellow and orange. I'm not going to try and make my camera focus on those. So let's get to the slime. I'm so excited. Okay. I like how in the description she tells you that she tried to make it smell like something else, but it didn't work out. That's honesty. So right away I can feel that it seems a little wet. Which isn't really... I think some cloud slimes are wet. At least that's what I've heard. I've only had cloud slime from one other person. Let's take it out. Comes out really easily. Ooh, look at this. It is really, really soft. It's really, 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 really soft. Okay. It's really soft. I don't even know what else to say because it's just so soft. Let's see if I can drizzle it. Ooh. Isn't that beautiful? This is why Cloud Slime is my favorite. Cloud Slime is my favorite. You know, while it's like that, let's put in the umbrella. Boop. 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 Look how 
cute! Look how cute this is! It's slime! Have you ever seen slime like this? I mean, I haven't. It's so cool! I love this! It's so cute and creative! I love it! <laughs> ah, I love this! Let's put in the sprinkles. One at a time, apparently, because I can't pick up more than one. I'm not sure if the sprinkles... Oh. I'm not sure if the sprinkles are suitable for this, but, you know, they're so small, I don't think you don't really notice them much. And they look really cute on there. Okay, so let's fold those in. I keep saying this, but it is really soft. It's super, super soft. And it really looks like sand when you drizzle it. I'm going to drizzle it again. Wow. Wow. Look at this. This is really nice cloud slime. I love cloud slime so much. Okay, I'm going to smell it now. It does smell like lotion, I think. I think all lotion smells different. It smells, it smells better than my lotion, for one thing. It smells like really, really good quality lotion. Ooh, it smells really good. It smells oceany. In my opinion, it smells oceany. I'm gonna smell it one more time. Yeah, it kind of smells oceany to me, like some kind of ocean-scented lotion. They do have those. Not joking. They really do have those. I'm gonna swirl it once more. Well, for the first time, I don't think I have swirled it in this video yet. Okay, put that in, put those in, okay, so I think that's it, I think that's all, I've shown you all the slimes that I have, I'm gonna drizzle this once more, and leave that for y'all to see while I give the Scape Stars review. Do some stretching. I wonder if slime can be considered exercising. I mean, playing with slime. Can we consider exercising? I mean, I stretch it a lot. Okay, so let's do this. Cover up that giant hole I had in it. Okay, so I am now going to give the Scape Stars review. Scape stars are my rating system where I rate 5 important categories out of 5 stars to see how good this toy really is. The categories are S for specialty, C for collectability, A for action, P for price, and E for entertainment. For S specialty, I am going to give these slimes a 4.8. And the reason why I'm not straight up giving them 5 stars like I really, really wish I could is because, well, these two slimes in particular, this honey one and this cola one, I have seen, I have seen slimes that are pretty much the same, not 100% the same, like I haven't seen one with hollow glitter, I haven't seen a cola one with hollow glitter, and I haven't seen a honey slime with the cute little sponges. But I have seen very similar ones, and they're so similar that I don't think I can give them five, five stars straight up, but I really, really, really want to, just because of this. Like, this one, on its own, gets five stars. But altogether, I will give them 4.8, which is still really, 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 really good. Usually, I just go for 4.5, but I can't even give them 4.5, I have to give them 4.8. Because, I mean, look at this. It's so special. It's so unique. Okay. Anyway. And this one is just... this. The pearl one is just kind of like a... You know, a, I'm not going to say common. It's just like... I think... um, It's not... It's definitely not like something you copy. It's just something... It's just an idea that a lot of people will have. And that's not bad. That's not wrong. I mean, if I purchase this, then obviously it's working. And this one is cute, too. Okay, so anyway, for C, collectability, I am giving them five stars because, as you can see, 
I only just discovered them and I already bought four slimes and I have this other one. I already have five slimes from them. Obviously, I am a little obsessed. Yeah, I mean, I really like it. I will definitely probably buy more slimes from them. Anyway, for A, for action, uh, everything does what it's supposed to do. They all stretch. They all, well, this one drizzles as it should. And they click. Well, most of them click. I, it was my fault that I couldn't get it to click. So they all do what they're supposed to do. None of them are sticky. I didn't even have to add any activator. But if I did have to add activator, it wouldn't be a problem. So five stars. For P for price. I will also be giving them five stars because if you can tell in US dollars at least, it's very cheap. Even in Malaysian ringgit, it's pretty dang cheap. This one was the most expensive one. It was 15 ringgit, which is, like I said, let me see, it's um, $3.60. And seeing as it came with these seashells and this umbrella, I think that's a really good deal. I'm not mad at all about that. So five stars for the price. And for E! Entertainment, well, if you could see throughout the whole video, I was pretty dang entertained. I'm very, I'm still pretty entertained. I mean, I just keep looking at this and it's just so dang pretty. It's so pretty. I found a sprinkle. <laughs> and so I'm very entertained. And if you were in, I said this in my other slime video as well. If slime it entertains you, then you will be entertained by this slime. So five stars for entertainment as well. So in total, the scape stars that she gets are five stars. In re um, to be exact, it is four point nine six stars. But I can't. It's not. It's not like four point nine because this it's a six at the end. If you know math, you know what I mean. So five stars. She got five stars. I'm so excited for her. Okay, or him. You know, I don't actually know. So I'm really, really happy with this purchase. I'm really happy with these slimes. I don't... I play it safe. I usually only buy slime from one person. And I will still definitely buy from that person. But I'm so happy to find another slimer that I like. I really like these. They're all really fun. And there's not really much fallout like she said there would be. There's a little bit, but really not that much. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to see me review more slimes from other shops. Yes, from other shops. And these shops as well. The shop is great. If you want to see me open up slimes and review slimes from other shops, please let me know and in the comment section. Let me know in the comment section. And I will try my best to bring you just that. Let's move this up a little bit. Okay. So let me know and I will do my best to bring you what you want. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more. I will probably be doing more slime videos. So yes, again, thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.